The theme of our next math chapter is how to solve quadratic equations. Everything is about solving quadratic equations. And so the whole question that has to go in your head is, what does it mean to solve a quadratic equation? Well, here we go. As a reminder, a quadratic equation in, in standard form looks like y equals ax squared plus bx plus c, where a cannot be 0. Um, as a reminder, if a is 0, then a times x squared is 0, and I do not have an x squared anymore. And if I don't have an x squared anymore, I don't have a quadratic equation. A quadratic equation looks like a parabola. I've done my best here on this graph to do that. Sometimes it's going up, sometimes it's going down. The solutions of a quadratic function are your x-intercepts, in this case at negative 4 and 4. And really what this means is this. Instead of saying y equals ax squared plus bx plus c, I want to know what x is when y is 0. Now we've done that before. I'm just reminding you that whatever x is when y is 0 is the solution to my quadratic equation. It's as simple as that. Solutions, x-intercepts, also roots and zeros. These are all the exact same thing. So in this chapter, whenever you hear solving a quadratic equation, we just want to know what is x when y is 0.